Sorry. If you guys could play a character in a different TV show, mm. what would you choose? Mm. Any show That's a fun any question. Yeah. Mm. I like that one. A character in a different TV show. TV show. TV, film, TV show from any decade. Mm. So it could be from Star yeah. Trek to 24, which I'm going to Any decade? Wow, you just opened yeah. up a whole you, So basically, if you could do anything. Wow. It's pretty simple for me. Yeah. I'd want to be Rachel from Friends. Wow. <laughs> the hair. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Good hair. Great yep. hair. <laughs> wow. And, hmm. Mm. Well, if you were Rachel, you would want to be Ross. Well, <laughs> so much. you wanted to be Ross? Kind of. Okay. It's okay. They fight over me all the time. It's, it's not. Don't, don't Wait, I'll be Joey because Joey got a turn with Rachel too. Did he? Yeah. I'll be Joey, probably. <laughs> you want to be. Uh, Okay, other than that, if you're going to be Rachel from Friends, I'd want to be uh, Christy Brown with Daniel Day-Lewis. My left foot. That's, that's not a TV show. Yeah, but if it was, <laughs> like if he was on Friends, I would be, the, like if he lived across, in the apartment, the other apartment across the hall, okay. he could be Rachel, I would be... The my left foot guy. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm, He's uh, driven and you're trying to around. think about what I want to be, and I think I've figured it out. I think either Farrah Fawcett or Super Dave Osborne, because I like One Piece unitards. Oh, oh I get that. Yeah. yeah. I get that. Well, Sorry couldn't you that. be the greatest American hero then, too? Yeah. Hmm. It's a good song, like too. Yeah. And my hair gets curly if it gets longer. Yeah. So I could have a blonde afro. Well, if we're going to go that route, I mean, just purely on One Piece, Leah, you know, unitard, unitard. outfits, I'd go, I'd want to be Mork. From mm. Morgan Whoa. Mindy. That's really good. Um, Alf. And if we're going Alf? there, I'd is like Alf to wearing a unitard though, or is that just his skin? No, it's a we one, don't know. It's a onesie. Well, it's a on, onesie. It's a one on his it's planet. One. So okay, other one piece. Uh, uh, Olivia Newton. The Fonz has Fonz. He wore his garage pieces. outfit. Yeah. Yeah. In the earlier seasons, he also jumped the yeah. shark in in a one piece. I believe. Yeah. Yeah. Evil yeah. Knievel um, style. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, Paul I Stanley would, from Kiss. He has a lot of chest hair. But that's not a TV show. No, it's not. But it but could be. It and they made a, really a movie. Show. <laughs> they made a movie. That's true. Oh, yeah. I'd want to. You it know was what? A great I'd, uh, movie too. It was I'd so want to be um, one of the um, uh, the Voltron kids. Oh, Voltron. Was Voltron. Good. What about G Force? Anybody remember G Force? No. Uh, no. No. <laughs> but Voltron. <laughs> wait, Voltron or Voltar? Voltron. 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 Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah I'd want. I want to be the fortune teller for big. I would like to be Destro. From G.I. Joe. Uh, that's a good one. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yes, it is. Who is the white ninja? Storm Shadow. Storm Shadow. I'd be Storm Shadow. That's another good one piece. Not that the question was about which one piece <laughs> character from G.I. Joe, but that's what it turned yeah. into. So. I turned it into Unitard talk. Yeah. That's all right. Sorry. All right. Please. Totally. I, think that's, I think that's our answer. Yeah. All so, of Individually and collectively. Um, have you guys enjoyed process of meeting fans when have you come to these events <laughs> we didn't know <laughs> we've never actually met one we don't we hope there are some out there yeah. but yeah. We, we, hear. we hear that there is three people who watch the show mm -hmm. but we've never met them no <laughs> they apparently live somewhere in estonia mm -hmm. um but we hope that that we just would like to say to the the three and a half people little person yeah thank you that we really appreciate you watching the yeah. show. It's basically because um, of you three that we get to and and do what we yeah. do. And have There's to one of us for each of you. Yeah. Because <laughs> we're all actually pretty large. So I guess one in, well. The half is for Emily because she's shorter. She's smaller. Smaller. Yeah, the half is for Emily. Mm -hmm. But uh, no, yes. We, um, wait, no yes? No yes. No. Uh, no. Yes. No. <laughs> Did it again. Just yeah. Lot of, lot of confusion. We, uh, we're, we're, we're very grateful when we get to, to meet the fans of the show and to th things like today are really fun. Yeah. Um, I think it was, what was the first, it was San Diego? No, 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 it was New York. Yeah. It was New York was last year, yeah. Comic-Con. Mm -hmm. Comic-Con in New York last year was the first time that we really got to experience, you know, the fans of the show um, up close. You know, we shoot the show in Nova Scotia and we don't really get to, you know, hear what people think or see. And in New York last year, we did a panel there, and mm. it was an amazing crowd. And you know, we did a, an autograph signing, mm -hmm. and we're all kind of shocked by by how many people actually watch the show and love the show. And we we see it on Twitter. I mean, I know you're not on Twitter, but 
Adam is now, and, and I see it with the fans on Twitter, and it's it's pretty humbling, I guess. Absolutely. And, and to be honest. Yeah. Because we're always sort of, I don't know about you guys, we're always sort of surprised <laughs> when we have that there are fans. Totally. We have, like, probably, I, well, not probably, like, definitely the, if there's a fan contest for coolest fans. Oh, yeah. In onesies. <laughs> in <laughs> unitards. <laughs> I just saw. I don't. You, you saw it, didn't you? The a, a fan of the show's got the, the, the guard the, symbol tattooed on the back of her calf. Yeah, um, and that was. That yeah, was when, when you move into to fans getting tattoos of something represented on your show or your product, then you know you're you're starting to, to strike onto something. Um, for me, it's been really fun. Um, over the last year and a half, I've started getting recognized as Dwight as opposed to Edge, which really blew my mind. I was like, whoa, you know Dwight, awesome, this is great. And then sit down and so what do you think? And that for me was a lot of fun. You know, right. For 20 years you get, you know, always recognized for this this thing and then, uh, you know, to be, to be um, you know, asked about something else was kind of, it was, it, it blew my mind a little bit, it was very cool. And then if you ask, so what do you think, then you get a, your mind boggled. But it did boggle. Sci-fi oh, fans, because no, sci-fi fans Sorry. are and fans of our show are like unbelievably precise. Well, and have these amazing theories about yeah. what's going on and in this world, and really put the time and energy into. Do you want to let her ask you a question? Yeah, oh yeah, you have a question. Guys. Oh, you want me to? We get for <laughs> stop <laughs> talking <laughs> there, so we can. Guys, so um, you've got Game of Thrones and Downton Abbey star Ian Glenn making a guest appearance on this new season of Haven. Yes. What was it like working with him, and who would win a fight between Haven, Game of Thrones, and Downton, and why? <sighs> okay. Did I always come? That's down such an unfair question. <laughs> well, first of all, because it's obviously us. We all have superpowers. <laughs> right. We would kick all of their asses. It's not about the casts of And downtown now we shouldn't even be in that. That's not right. fair. They're very right. polite, sweet people. We wouldn't we would not fight them because we're Because gentlemen. they'd probably <laughs> right. right. But But do you think they might get dirty though? They might fight you anyway. They probably yeah. Mm-hmm. Like pouring hot tea on us and stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Throwing old bedpans, I don't know what they do. Very <laughs> very dangerous. <laughs> Hot tea in bed. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, like downtown, I became like some kind of like prison. <laughs> yeah. The um, Game of Thrones guys might kick your asses, mightn't they? They're no, pretty they nasty. Would. Well, more importantly, who do you think would win? Yeah. Oh, it, it's not for me to say. Right. <laughs> okay. Well, first of all, Ian Glenn was a real gentleman, a lovely man. I wouldn't want handsome to fellow. Very handsome. chiseled. Ap- Hugely chiseled. You use that word in such a creepy way. Yeah. <laughs> no, a real, but, but a real chiseled. <laughs> when you then see the episode, good, yeah. when you see the episode, you realize that in in some ways, no one really got to work with him. He's there. I mean, we're, but we all we we met him. We hung out with him for a little bit, and he was lo- uh, absolutely lovely, lovely chap. Uh, I would not want to fight him. I would have no reason to fight him. And he would well, not him. him. We wouldn't have to fight him specifically. There's other people on Game of Thrones that we would fight. Ooh. I personally, I I I could take down Peter Dinklage. Well. <laughs> Me and I Peter. Don't know. He's already halfway there. I don't know. I think I could take him. I, I, I know you. You know what? No, man, you are. No, you're right. I probably I'm not, couldn't. I'm not trying to call you a a a, a weak no. or anything. He's actually a really really. Strong person and a great fighter, but you know who I could take though is um, the little king, the thirteen-year-old, oh, yeah, 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 the, the little mm, yeah, Joffrey. Yeah, yeah. Joffrey, Joffrey, yeah, Joffrey, yeah. I'd beat his ass. Yeah. <laughs> and would you bring out some of your signature WWE moves on anyone? Wouldn't need to. Wouldn't need to. You'd do it anyway. Yeah. Yeah. This forehead does a lot of bad things, <laughs> so yes, stick with that. And I'd just be like standing behind those guys, being like. Drinking coffee. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just waiting. Yeah, you've missed one. Yeah. Yeah. I like the high pitched crack to it too. Yeah. Turn yeah, kind of Australian nice. there. Come on, game of yeah. like that. Make it Australian too. Get Dinklage. All right, guys. <laughs> Sorry.